Oh my. What is happening? <laughs> oh my gosh. What's up guys, Dapper here, and today we are building a hover forklift. Um, so I wanted to do something cool where if you like push the top button, it would go, uh, and if you let go, it would stop and stay wherever it's at. Unfortunately, that doesn't quite work in this game um so i tried building some logic sequences here and uh well as you can see it's a little bit glitchy <laughs> um it does slightly work the only thing is there's such a delay in the circuits that it would only work for going halfway and well that's just not really worth that much i don't think um i guess i would just rather it go all the way to the top smoothly than only be able to go halfway anyway so even if the pulses happened way 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 quicker and it was stable uh it still wouldn't be that worth it to me I don't think so we are going to scrap this idea all right perfect so we will scrap this we will go with the on and off switches top one will be for that bottom one will be for that perfect so yeah, we'll have two stages, there and there, and also there. Now, we might need to have this go lower depending on... Yeah, I'm probably going to have to redo that. So we're building a hovercraft, right? So this is going to be floating, and if we're going to be picking up some sort of pallet, or whatever... We'll probably need this to go lower than the actual vehicle. But we'll get there. Let's um let's work on looks for now, I suppose. And like everything else I make, this is guaranteed to tip. So, when getting started, stabilizers. Please don't tip. Ugh. No. All right, moment of truth. Hey, it's upright. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right, I'll work on it over here. No big deal. Um, let's do... Oh, right. We need a computer. So, we will find a hovercraft. We'll stick that right there for now. So let's go ahead and do that. And of course my game would crash at that very moment. Awesome. And we're back. Sweet. Oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my, oh. Ooh. Easy there, easy. Okay. Let's take away the extra one up front for now. Oh, 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 no, no, no. 
No, no, no. Oh. Oh my gosh. What is... Really? Um... It would. It would just flip on me for no reason. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> oh, this has been a disaster so far. Okay, okay, okay. Um... Okay, 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 okay. Okay, well, I'm just gonna Easy. skip this ahead to when I have something working. <laughs> wow. Well, all right then. Um, <laughs> I guess I need to work on this some more because that is not gonna work. What is happening? <laughs> oh my gosh. Aha! All right. Okay. Okay. Bring that back down. Okay, we're gonna move those there. We're going to connect this bad boy. Just like so. And, and, gonna delete those. Gonna do that. We're gonna do that. Nice and easy. And we got it. We did it. Nice. Wow, I can't believe that works. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, so we need to build this out a little bit, obviously. I just wanted to see if that would actually work. And uh, it works good enough. Good enough for me. So. Then hopefully it doesn't freak out. I forgot about this part. Okay, so it's probably gonna freak out. But. Oh wait, ah, I did it wrong. <laughs> But it worked! It worked! Holy cow! Okay! Sick! Okay, let's um... Let's pick a warehouse! Actually... Hold on, what do I do next? I could totally build onto this forklift. Hmm. Okay. Here's what we'll do. We'll build a little bit of a warehouse. Maybe some more pallets. We'll do a little more testing. And we'll build up the forklifts a little bit. Make it look nice. And go.
see you see this this is why i can't have nice things guys here it is the finished forklift so the one two and three keys operate the forklift one will have the first go two will have the second and three will uh, lock whatever you decide to pick up so it's like the mag lock there, back there, behind the forklift plate. So yeah, all we need now is a warehouse. So, I'll be right back. What's up guys, welcome back. Uh, welcome to my office. Uh, I may have went slightly overboard <laughs> with the warehouse. Uh, so let me take you on a tour real quick. Here it is. <laughs> oh gosh, I made like the little stairs to go up there. Um, so yeah, somebody left a bunch of pallets out and uh we are gonna go ahead and put those away real quick so let me hello where... oh here it is <laughs> i was like where's the forklift uh as you can see we already have a pallet on here so let's go ahead and drop that off real quick oh what's the wrong button there we go so yeah, this build actually turned out fantastic. I'm actually loving it a lot. It's actually really fun to kind of go about and uh, put things away and whatnot. As you can see, I put a bunch of stuff away already. So yeah, let's go ahead and kind of show this off. Oh, 
that's a bad way to start. All right, let me uh, fix my approach here. Yeah, it's really cool. You can actually do this in first person too, which here I'll attempt right now. Go ahead and grab that. So we got it. By using the three key, we'll go ahead and back up. Hopefully I don't hit anything. And yeah, let's, uh, let's put it away over here. Hopefully this doesn't glitch out. It's glitched out on me a couple times, but hey, it works pretty well. So we're gonna go ahead and line up right about here. It probably should be further over, but oh well, there's nothing else up there. So we'll go ahead and turn in. Oh, there's a little bit of glitchiness. Probably hitting something. Let's back out here. Ooh, got a little too close there. All right, here, let's try this. Let's just put it away nicely. There we go. <laughs> it only glitches out sometimes. Here, let's go grab another one. <laughs> okay. Here, let's get this guy over here. So yeah, this actually turned out really awesome. I'm actually really loving this. Oop. Although I'm a really bad forklift driver. <laughs> here we go. Let's line up. Perfect. Got it. Let's do the second level again. I'll do it over here since this one's kind of bare. So yeah, I'll approach from the left side a little bit more and then right about here is where we can turn. Nice. And then we will gently put it away. Perfect. That one was nice. See, it works most of the time. <laughs> Only when I record does it mess up. All right. Let's go over here and grab these two guys. Let's do the top level this time. Oh, smash it a little bit there. Let's line up here. Perfect turn. It even turns like a forklift. I've only driven a couple of forklifts in my life, but uh feel like this is this is basically it you know uh, let's do the top row in the back over here I don't see nothing up there so we'll go down this aisle and let's put it away right about here I'm actually gonna raise the forks up right now back out the camera so we can see what we're doing here Look at that. Nice. All right, I think we only got one more to go. So let's go ahead and grab that and put it away. So this one's kind of angled weird. I actually, I can get it over here. I might, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna squeeze in over here. I even put the lines down so that, uh, you know, if other forklifts were operating in the area. Squeeze in here. That's good enough. Grab that. And hey, let's just put it in the bottom here. Why not? Perfect. Yeah, so this was actually a really fun build. These are actually not grabbable. Uh, I was planning on making a bunch of different pallets, but I ended up just going with uh, like three. Um, so these were just like a, something that I could copy and paste. And then the stickers wouldn't copy over. So that's why a lot of them are blank. But I also have a surprise over here. <laughs> oh, here's the, uh, the test one. This one still has tons of issues. If you ever, if I ever drive this one, uh, it literally just scrapes the ground as it goes. It flies, does crazy things. So yeah, that's why I built a whole new one. <laughs> so I thought I'd keep that one around. Uh, but 
I made a special one behind this wall and I'll show it to you here. This one is a monster forklift here. It can barely drive it so heavy. Now let me go ahead and grab that. Oh, I can't see. I'll have to come out of here first person. And <laughs> look at that. <laughs> uh, so I made this uh, giant rack over here. As you can see, we're scraping because we're so heavy. Let's go ahead and ease it on over here. <laughs> look at that. There it goes. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and throw this on the top row here. Oh, man. Uh, like right here? Before I turn? Oh, it doesn't want to turn. It's so heavy. Almost there. What about right there? Perfect. <laughs> Yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, let me know if you like the build, if you'd like to see me do more of this in the future. Uh, some of the plans are to maybe add like a loading dock so that I can load up some uh, cargo trucks or something along those lines. And uh, yeah, if you guys want to mess around with this build, uh, I'll be posting it to the workshop and I will be putting a link in the description so that you can find it. Uh, I'll probably put the warehouse and the forklift uh, on there. So yeah, if you like this video, be sure to smash that like button and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.